Here at Westridge, we like to offer our students as many opportunities for self-improvement as possible. We do this through our many elective classes. Uh, right now, we're busy getting ready um, for our quarter two celebration concert. Um, we're singing a bunch of holiday music, some about snow, some about a guy you might have heard of, Jolly Old St. Nicholas. Um, you should definitely consider joining choir. We are the largest uh, group here at Westridge. We have almost 200 kids in choir. And the great thing about choir at Westridge is it's actually a class, so you don't have to come before school or stay after, it's during the day. Um, so if you want to be a part of the largest group at Westridge, join choir. My name is Mr. Reese. I'm the industrial arts teacher. Uh, I teach two classes that you can take as seventh graders. One is called automation and robotics, and one is called design and modeling. In automation and robotics, we build a lot of different um, mechanisms. This is some of the mechanisms that you will build during class. Uh, you'll learn about how these mechanisms work, what kind of tools and machines they're used in, and how they can help uh, you perform work. Um, we also, you also have the opportunity to build, design and build your own robot race car, and we have a class race uh, where you get to compete against the other students in your class. And there are some problem solving activities as well. This class is a hands-on class. Uh, it's very little time of me standing in front of you giving you directions. It's mostly you designing your own project, uh, figuring out how the pieces work together and how you can use your design to accomplish your goal. If you like building, uh, you will love robotics. Another class that we have is design and modeling. This has several hands-on projects, but it also uses the computer quite a bit more than the robotics class does. In this class, we build what's called an air skimmer. It's kind of like a paper airplane, but it's more like a hovercraft that glides along the ground. Uh, we, you also have the chance to learn how to use a program called Autodesk Inventor. I, through using Autodesk Inventor, you'll be able to create your very own project that we, use, we print out with the 3D printers that are in the classroom. These are phone stands that were designed by students a few years ago. Uh, you get to design your own project, you print it out on the 3D printer and you get to take it home with you. So if you are interested in engineering, if you like working with your hands, if you like putting things together, if you like using computers to help you solve problems, then this is the kind of class for you.